All right, everybody. What up? So today I'm going to teach you how to remove child nodes by just clicking on the parent node. There's a lot of confusion about this, but by the end of this tutorial, you should get the main idea and apply it to your own code. Okay? So what we first need is we know about event listeners. We know how to create text node, child nodes, uh, and all that stuff, create elements. But, and now that you understand what parent nodes are and what child nodes are, we can apply it now. So, we're going to apply a parent node to this unordered list. Okay? And its ID is ulist. So, we got to get that first. So, var ulist equals document dot get element by ID ulist. Right? So we're going to add an event listener to that, and it's going to have a click event, right? And we're going to add the li tags, right? So list, li list, we'll call it that. Document dot get elements by tag name, all right? So li. All right, so what's going to happen here is if you look at the DOM, right? That's what we got. The body of it, the unordered list, has child nodes, right? The child nodes are the allies, right? As you can see, this is a parent node. So, first we have to tell the script or JavaScript what we want to target. Right, so var target equals we want to target these allies. So, first, what we have to do is get the ally tags, right? So, we did that. So, ally list, and then we want to target the first ally every time we click on the u, u list. Whenever we click on it, it's going to get the first one and take that out. Right, that's our goal. So we have to target that. So we state that and then we put in parent node. Right? And then remove child. And the reason why we have to get the parent node is because by stating the parent node here, we could access the remove child property. Right? And then we could say what we want to remove. It's kind of in a circular fashion, but that's the way to do it, right? So we have to state the list item. We're taking this out. Think of it as first you're stating the target, and then you have to t tell it it's a parent node. And then after that, you have to tell what the parent node has to remove, and once again, it's a target, all right? So let's test this out. So take this out. I just did that for you guys to understand. So whenever we click, see that? It's deleting it. So what's happening is it's targeting the parent node, right? And removing the child, which is the list item. Right? So it gets pretty confusing how that works, but as you do it more and more, you'll start to understand the circular fashion of it. It's just that you have to access uh, this property, and to get that, you have to go through the parent node property to get in there, right? So just think of it as you stating the target first, and then stating the parent node of that, and then removing its child, right? Whenever you want to remove a child from a parent node. Okay? So once again, let's demonstrate that. Oh, what did I do? Fresh, one, two, three, four, and in the DOM tree, deleted the child notes. All right. So hopefully you got that. I think that's pretty clear on it. Apply it to your own code. Make magic happen. And yeah, I'll see you in the next tutorial. Like, subscribe. Just don't kill anybody. You know how it goes. Peace.